Moving on now, after spending nearly six years in the space, Japan's Hayabusa 2 spacecraft has brought samples collected from a distant asteroid back to Earth. The capsule brought samples of asteroid Ryugu, about 300 million kilometers away from Earth. The spacecraft landed on Australia's Woomera earlier today. The spacecraft has brought samples of rocks and dust from the surface of the asteroid. The capsule will be collected by a recovery team and will be taken to the Japanese Aerospace Exploration Agency's lab for further studies. And according to scientists, the samples could help explain the origins of solar system and life on Earth. Hayabusa 2 left the asteroid Ryugu a year ago after it released the capsule. It moved away from Earth to capture images of the capsule descending towards the planet as it set off a new expedition to another distant asteroid. The capsules return to Earth with the world's first asteroid subsurface. Samples comes weeks after NASA's OSIRIS-REx spacecraft made a successful touch-and-go grab of surface samples from asteroid Bennu. Now the NASA spacecraft stored the samples safely in October and is expected to return that to Earth in 2023. For a second, oh my God. Tag vertical velocity. <laughs> Co-presented by Skoda. Simply clever.